Cincinnati's building a streetcar, and some people in northern Kentucky hope that maybe one day it will cross the river. Our local 12's Anjanette Levy spoke with one city leader who would like to see Newport, Covington, and Cincinnati all connected by rail. A number of people are coming up to me and saying, are we going to have that discussion? What are the chances of, you know, hooking into what Cincinnati's doing? Covington Mayor Sherry Karen says it's time to start talking about bringing light rail to northern Kentucky. The idea was studied 12 years ago, but nothing materialized. As a child growing up in Cincinnati, Karen rode streetcars. Northern Kentucky also had a streetcar system. One part was called the Green Line. With people in their busy schedules, they're looking for a way to get to work in a timely fashion. They, they want to be able to leave a spot at a certain time and get to a spot by a certain time. And light rail is one of the best ways to do that. This is one of the spots in Covington where the streetcars ran until the 1950s. That's when they were overtaken by buses. Some business owners over here in Covington are watching what's happening in Cincinnati with the streetcar there. And they're hoping the system can make a comeback here as well. It works uh, in Cincinnati. It's going to work here in Covington. Johnny Chu owns Amer Asia on Madison Avenue. He would support building a rail system that would connect Covington to Newport and Cincinnati. He believes it would help businesses and... When you have a streetcar, that's going to help, you know, with the less pollution through the air. Nothing is in the works yet, but Mayor Karen says to make anything happen, you have to start talking about it. It would have to be sensitive to the, you know, the history, uh, the historic structure of our city. Yeah, and, and it can be done. It's done in other cities. In Covington, Anjanette Levy, Local 12 News. And Mayor Karen may travel to Portland this fall to see that city's streetcar system. Newport City Commissioner Beth Fennels also is interested in bringing rail to northern Kentucky.